Hello everyone, this is Lamin Sane of Code Logical, and in today's video, we're going to be starting a brand new series called Ember.js Simple Shopping Cart System. But before we start um, diving into the first um, coding session, I just want to make you aware of some prerequisites. Um, this will be a different um, playlist or you know sub um, course to the first one that I did, which was just introducing the Ember concepts. So if you hadn't watched that, I urge you to watch at least the first five videos so you'll get to grips with some basic Ember concepts. And the more you watch, the better it is. And um, in this course, we will need the Ember app kit. And in addition to that, you'll need Ember data as well because we'll be making models and stuff like that. Okay. So with that out of the way, let's dive in. So in this first video, we're going to be um, actually the, in, the course will be about a simple shopping cart system. and. The features included will be um, you'll have the ability to list um, products and add a new product, edit the product and delete the product. And also um, in future, I'll add some more features like adding reviews to a product and being able to rate a product whilst you're adding the review as well. So let's dive in. So in this video, we'll just list the products on the home page. So first of all, what we have to do is create a product model. So inside our app.js, I'll just say app dot um, product equals to ds dot model dot extend so what properties does the product have a product has a name that's just a simple attribute and it has a description that's just also a simple attribute as well and last but not least it has a price that's also a simple attribute okay so next what we have to do is set the um, adapter for the product to the fixture adapter since we won't be dealing with a server in this um, series as well uh, maybe in another series we'll add a server there so we can when we refresh the page we'll still see our data um, stored and retrieved so let's just change that by saying app dot um, product adapter equals to es dot fixture adapter dot extend and if this is not familiar i urge you to watch my previous series um, which is introduction to ember and i covered the fixture adapters in slightly more detail there okay so next let's add um, product fixtures so we'll just say app dot product um, dot fixtures go to and if you remember um, for fixtures you have to create an array and you have to put an ID for each item in the array and in this case let's say um, one and the name of this um, product is let's say PlayStation 3 and we'll give it a description and the description will be last gen control um, with the best exclusive Okay, and then we'll set the price to it as well. So let's just say 200 pounds, all right? We won't put a um, format to the currencies, we'll just leave it as numbers, just to keep it simple. And two, we'll just duplicate that as well, and we'll just say Xbox 360. I'll just say last gen console with the best add-ons, like Kinect. I think Xbox had the best add-ons and it's slightly cheaper um, from where I'm, I am, which is England, UK. And um, yeah, so with the fixtures out of the way, let's um, change the index route here. Instead of now returning this array of colors, we'll just query the fixtures. So we'll just say this dot store dot find product. Okay, so now that will query this list of fixtures here and give us that instead of the colors array. And then finally, we'll just change the loop on the index template to show product name. So here we are in the loop here. So we'll just say each product in model. Since it's an array, we'll just say instead of just item, we'll have to say product.name. Okay, so let's check that in our browser. And if everything works, you'll see a list of products. So here we are in our browser and when we refresh as you can see we have playstation 3 and the xbox 360 from the fixtures that we created 
so um that's it for this video and um, in the next video we'll see how to um create dedicated product pages and display more details about a product and linking to that product as well so thanks for watching i'll see you soon in another video cheers bye bye